What is up everybody? Thank you so much for stopping by at the channel. Today is really, really exciting because we have finally, Jameson and I have finally gotten these rockers and cab corners done. I got uh, Sergeant Streeter, he's in the army. He's back in his trailer in right now. And we're gonna load that bed that is, if I, if I could sell it to anybody, it would be him because he's a good battle buddy of mine. So we served together in the military. But yeah, here's my rusty and crusty bed. I, I guess he needs it. We'll see why here in a minute once he backs that giant thing in here. But you know, the I, everything else is pretty sound on this other than the wheel wells. I mean, what would, what would you do if you were on a budget? Fender flares. Fender flares. Just, just, cut, just cut the rust out yeah. and put fender flares. Yeah. I think it's a great idea. Oh, I'm telling you, I'm soaking it up. <laughs> yeah, we got three Duramaxes in the driveway right now. This is, well, not right now. He's coming down the road. Hey, not bad for an MP. I mean, you're not an 88 Mike, but you know. You did a great job. You have a driveway the size of a freaking parking spot. That is true. You did a really good job because that's a 90 right there. So here's the bed if you want to look at it. Actually, why are, did, is it on this? It, look, we got to see why. Oh, well, hang on now. It's, it doesn't look that bad. Oh, the body line's creased. Well, let's have the body man look at the, it. The body man. You tell me. <laughs> if you can get that corner out, it's going to be nothing. Because it's, it's pushed down like that, which has made that buckle out. Mm -hmm. So you'd have to pull that all out. JL Collision, Leslie, Michigan. <laughs> Check them out. <laughs> but, yeah. So would it be worth just throwing this one on that has rusty wheel wells yeah how do you feel knowing that you're going to be the owner of truck master's crappy bed it's better than my crappy bed you're gonna have to bend that i forgot to tell you that yeah, mine's bent too um but yeah overall it's not a bad bed it's just I, don't, I mean there's not a lot of dings or anything on it really you have to worry about it. it's just the rust like right in there right there and then on this side, it's really bad. You'd have to take all this off, get it down to bare metal. Otherwise, that's just gonna bubble up underneath here anyhow. Yeah, that's true. See, that at that point, you know what? There's another thing I wanted to throw at you. That's pretty bad. Wasn't too bad with three guys. Well, we got her on. Hopefully you can work with that. I don't know what your plan is. We'll figure that out in the long run. And of course I have my rust free bed right here. The only problem with this one no. is that, which is kind of annoying, but that's not that big of a deal. It's gonna get fixed. It's gonna get repainted. It's gonna look beautiful when it's done. Oh, and by the way, the Duramax Life decals are still for sale. Uh, if you go in the link in the, if you click on the link in the description below, you'll see it. Just click on it. They're ten dollars on eBay. I actually owe Streeter one. He's been asking me. There it is. So, you guys get yours way faster than I do, and I live right around the corner. <laughs> My bad. Here, Jameson. Oh, sweet. Put on your toolbox. Perfect. Or whatever. Yeah. He's gonna attempt to swing this. How, how how long is this trailer anyways? Deck is 25 plus five, overall is what, 32? 32 feet. He's gonna attempt to pull this out at this pretty much straight 90 degree. We'll see how he does. <laughs> I 
Oh, he's got this all day. <laughs> he had that all day. That was too easy. By the way, not to keep the suspense going, guys, but I am. The truck is going to be a completely different color, and it's not going to be black. So you guys need to stay tuned and follow my build because right now, like I said, we just got the rockers completely done. Stay tuned for that how-to video. It's going to be very enlightening, uh, especially for some of you guys that have never done rockers and cab corners and you are considering doing it. Or if you just want to see it to see the process, it's it's a lot more than I imagined. I'll tell you that it's not just an, a weekend project. Um, if you want to do it correctly, is kind of where I'm getting at. But we'll talk more about that later, guys. Um, thank you so much for stopping by at the channel. You guys are great. Uh, thanks for all the new subscribers and you guys that are continuing to follow the build. We'll see you on the next video. Take care.